Well, it seems like a lot of us are on this uh, Eminem kick as of late. And we finna get into it, y'all. But first, y'all know how we do. <laughs> Intro! Yo, it's me, your boy, JJV. What is good, fam bam? It is your boy, Jason JV, saying welcome to another uh, reaction video. And yes, yes, y'all. It's been a while since we reacted to some Swift Homicide. It's been a while. And yes, yes, yes. Speaking of Swift Homicide, the homie did actually hit me up on IG not too long ago. So shout out to the homie Swift, Swift Homicide. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, man, we still keep in touch, you know what I'm saying, every now and again, you know what I mean, it's always great to hear from the homie, and, uh, yeah, man, can't wait to get into this one, so apparently my man did a remix to one of Eminem's, uh, latest songs, um, off of his Houdini album, and, or no, excuse me, Death of Slim Shady album, I don't know why I had Houdini on the brain, but anyway, excuse me, um, and speaking of, uh, yes, we will be finishing, uh, the album review, I have not forgotten. I've just been busy with a lot of things. Cars acting up, so I got to get that thing in order. And yeah. And then, of course, you know, the whole Upchurch ACAL situation. You know what I'm saying? If you want to know more about that, check out my ACAL review video, uh, if you will. It's one of my most recent releases that you can find in the archives. Uh, but anyway, let's go ahead and get into the task at hand. I did promise the homie that I would look look into this this remix that he did this is a remix of eminem's evil again off of the death of some shady album which we will be finishing the album review of and uh yeah so the homicide remix he calls it wicked and i gotta say i like the artwork here you got my man you know standing with a machete ready to hack somebody's dome piece off and then there's, and there's a mirror right there and in the reflection it looks like he's been in contact with a venom like symbiote I man, I man be rocking that, you know, that 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 venom grill, you know what I mean, with the tongue out and everything. Yeah, so yeah let's get into this, y'all. Once again, so Thomas Side Wicked. This is the Eminem Evil Remix. Without further ado, like the hit here. Yeah, looks like it's about that time again. So Thomas Side nigga. I gotta say, I do like the venom-like voice. Let's go. Fuck everybody, nigga. And by the way, fun fact, I still have my Swift Homicide decal on my car. On the rear rear window. Oh yeah, let's go. Anybody could get it. You did it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Looks like I'm right back in my ruthless ways. Y'all can hate it. Beefing with me's like serving death row. You could get shot and ate it. I'm my man talking about being back in his ruthless ways. You know what I mean? Yo, you want and you want beef with me, man? It's gonna be like 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 signing your name on, on death row. You know what I'm saying? Bro, let's go. I like the death row reference, by the way. And yes, your boy does have a uh replica death row uh medallion, you know what I'm saying? The pendant and everything. Bro. The chain, bro, let's go. I'm ice on the microphone, you yellow bellies cannot debate it. So if I am not the goat, then that would mean to you know what? Let me grab that real quick. Oh, yeah, y'all. Ain't nothing but a gangster party, party. Gotta rock the Death Row medallion since my man done made the reference. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. All right. Let's get the phones back on and get right back, back into this dang thing. Tupac's Jamaican. Shit when I kick ass. Oh, my man made a Tupac reference. Let me run that back. Not the goat, then that would mean two pots Jamaican. Shit, when I kick ass this fast, nigga, one punch, you get whiplash. Got a gun tucked for your bitch ass, keep your distance. But if you run up, you could get stabbed. I'm the scientist in this lab. You niggas are just shit slabs and ditches. Better reconsider. I gotta say, I do like the, the doubling up. Um, I'm not sure if, if I'm a fan of that delay, though. I kind of wish that uh, it was more in line. Like the the background vocals were more in line with the end pieces, you know what I mean, to make it more like like a like a clean double. That's just my preference, though. I do like the uh, direction my man is going with this one. It's got that horrorcore flair, that horrorcore flavor, which you know your boy's a big fan of. As a matter of fact, the homie did check out my song, "Devil on My Shoulder." You know what I'm saying? Told me it was fire, which I do appreciate, by the way. <clears throat> and he was promoting it on IG. So again, 
make sure you shout out for my, for my man for showing your boy some love. So, you know, you know I got to return the favor and put him on as well. You know what I'm saying? Bro, let's go. Your mission before you go and pop off at the mouth. We all know that I'm that one you should have asked about. Body count so high, it's too late to try to catch me now. When they said homicide was outside, who you think that's about? Quick dumb. Mm, I love that, man. The body count so high, man. It's too late to catch me now. When they talk about a homicide outside, who you think they talking about? I like that, man. Let's go. Pack your genesis like Sega fans with a hand cannon so big, I nicknamed it Mega Man. Raise and train the pack. Head cannon so big, my nickname is Mega Man. Mm, so I like to play on his name, and I like how he worked into... You know, the play with the video game character, Mega Man. Let's go. The blade, they say that I got Vega hands. I'm the type to sign an autograph. They say I got Vega hands. The character Vega from Street Fighter. Let's go. Across the line, all the racers stand. I'm from the city where we stay strapped like snow boots. Lyrical Superman, this here is my telephone booth. One mm, the lyrical Superman, this here is my, my, tone, my phone booth. Is that how you said that? Let me see that. How, how you say that? No boots. Lyrical Superman, this here is my telephone booth. So lyrical Superman, this here is my phone booth. Okay. Wanna challenge me to some levels you gotta go through. Though I said I can't be faded, it's become necessary to show you. Got sent to hell, became the ruler. My music's lethal to the. I like that. You got got sent to hell and became the ruler. So it's like it's a play on that old saying, you know, heaven wouldn't have me and hell's afraid I'll take over. You know what I mean? So got sent to hell, became the ruler. Bro, let's go. The earlobes like Donald Trump shooters. Machete. My man that made the Donald Trump shooting reference. So to the earlobes like Donald Trump shooters. Ooh. Machete ready to rip from Ruder to the Tudor. Make the pistol hot to a, you don't come up. So we go from shooting Donald Trump's earlobe to the hot to a chick. Bruh, bruh, let's go. Off the Mueller, you being a pooler. Your own blood spitting up faster than bone thugs. You know what? I like the Bone Thugs reference. Let's go. I could get sick of off of the liquor. Take a fifth of gin, mix it with the Hennessy. Now I'm a sinner. Take your liver, take a bite, then I toss it in the river. Bitch, if you look into my eyes, you see the killer cap split. I won't wait for the. Mm. So he mentioned Bone Thugs earlier, and then he made, a, then he said, you know, the look into my eyes. It's funny because Bone Thugs actually have a song called Look Into My Eyes. Look into my eyes and tell me what it is you see. And look into my eyes. Look into my eyes and tell me what it is you see. And, bruh, let's go. And I'll raise the dead like Michael Jack's thriller. You already know I'm coming for you. I don't need a mask, nigga. So my bad, y'all. Let me catch that last part. Uh. Sit with the Hennessy, now I'm a sinner. Take your liver, take a bite, then I toss it in the river. Bitch, if you look into my eyes, you see the killer cap split. I won't wave the hand, I'll raise the dead like Michael Jackson's thriller. You already... Oh, I like that. So won't wave my hand, I'll raise the dead like Michael Jackson's uh, thriller. Let's go. No, I'm coming for you, I don't need a mask, nigga. Alright y'all, so that was Swift Homicide with Wicked. It is the Eminem Evil Remix. And uh, yeah, man, I, I love it. You know what I mean? It's my man doing that horrorcore uh, thing. You know what I mean? Being being in that horrorcore bag, which I love. I appreciate. I love horrorcore music. So you definitely won me over with that. You know what I'm saying? And uh, again, Swift, if you're watching this, man, shout out to you for showing my song, uh, Devil on My Shoulder. Uh, love, man. Really appreciate that as well. Uh, overall, I do like the song. I like what you said in it. You know what I mean? My only real complaint, my only real issue is that long trail you left right there in the end. You know what I mean? Where it's just all instrumental right there. I would have cut that a little bit short or I would at least, you know, promote, you know, 
myself, you know what I mean? Like, like yes, you know, I, w- I would have said my name. If this was my song, I would be like, you know what I mean? I'd be like, yo, JJV, and then represent who I'm with, you know, Thursday Night Records and all that stuff. I would have done the same thing here. Swift Homicide, and then, you know, if you're affiliated with, with, with a group or something, man, put that on there, you know what I mean? Or if you got a new album coming out, plug the album, you know what I mean? Something, like, I would have did something there to kind of fill in some of that, that, that tale that, that you left there at the end, you know what I mean? Rather than just letting it drag out like that. But that's just me, though. You know what I mean? It is a creative creative decision. This is the man's art, so I have to respect it as such. You know what I'm saying? Um, but all in all, not a bad song, man. I, I dug it. Um, I loved it. I love the references. I love some of the, the uh, lines that you use in there that reference some things. You know what I mean? It really got my, ma- my mind uh, going and thinking about some things. You know what I mean? And so, yeah. All right, y'all. That's pretty much all I got to say. Swift Homicide. Uh... Yeah, it's a Swift Homicide Wicked. It is the remix of Eminem's Evil. Make sure y'all go check it out. I will have the link posted in the description down below so y'all can show the homie some love. I mean, let him know that your boy JJV done sent you. I'm sure he would appreciate that, as would I. And y'all know the deal. Like, comment, share, and of course, subscribe, especially if you're new and you're digging the vibes. It'll be very much appreciated. Don't forget, there's other links in the description down below if you want to support the channel, buy some merch. You know what I mean? Totally up to you. But until then, y'all know the deal. It's your boy Jason JV. So y'all take care. Have a blessed one. I'll catch y'all next one. Peace. Jason JV on YouTube. Uh, what's up with you, Jason JV? What up, Jason JV? I'm just sending love, peace, and blessings to you. Jason, you are my homeboy, my guy. Don't call me guy, pal. Don't call me buddy, pal. Much love to you, JV. Chris Calico. Cali, baby. Oh. What's up, JV? My name's Jimmy Patrick. I'm happy to do it on the street. Who's saying such a new thing? Keep your motherfucking head up. Uh, uh. So subscribe, tap the little bell, turn on the notifications, and if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it, yeah!